So again, I'm, I'm hanging out here with uh, my good friend, Mr. Graffiti Yellow, Thunder's inspired, Thunder's model, rock and roll roller guitar. Um, double cutaway. Super cool. I mean, this guitar really feels great. Billy and his, and his group of uh, keyboard elves, they have done a, an excellent job of putting together and capturing, I think, something that will harken back to what we, a lot of us grew up with playing, and that's rock and roll guitars that had a great feel and a great vibe. Uh, you know, these guys were, the detail is amazing, the checking, the feel, the weight. Look at this. So it's super light, but yet it's got, it's got balls. Um, shall I say that? It says lack of mother so again, again, inspired by a band that influenced a lot of uh, bands through the years, especially the late '70s, early '80s, glam rock bands, you know that kind of stuff. And um, I myself played uh, juniors uh, at different times. Billy's played juniors through the years, and um, he did something that um, that uh, I plan on stealing when this is all over, and that's this guitar. Um, I don't know if you guys can see the checking, but it's, again, really well thought out. Super cool rock guitar. This is one of my favorite parts. I love the black. Can you see the black back on the, on the back of the headstock there? You got serial number and all that. Does serial number mean anything? <laughs> Probably not. Anyways. Uh, the next... You know, you need a little bit of beef on them, so these aren't going to be like tiny little baby skinny necks. Though, I guess if you wanted one with one, you could get one, right guys? Yeah? Hey, yeah. Absolutely. And um, chunky baseball neck. So depending on your hand size, Rock and Roll Relics can take this guitar, kind of customize it into what you kind of want to do, whether it's graffiti yellow or, um, you know, puke green. Uh, he'll, he's got it covered. Natural wood. You can really pretty much do anything. So, um, but at the end of the day, it's really about the sound. It's about um, the combination of the wood and then these monster pickups that are in here. You know, I think the, uh, up here in the Bay Area, the collaboration of Rock and Roll Relics and David Allen pickups is is well thought out because again, the whole idea is to capture something organic, straightforward rock and roll. It's not you know, too scientific, because rock and roll was never really meant to be that way. But the knowledge that these two guys have in putting together bodies and, and look and color and then sound um, is is really important. And so you got this really great combination of, of uh, and I keep, I keep saying rock and roll because really that's what it is all about. Um, to, you, you know, you want to play some rock and roll riffs, you get sounds like this. The Firebird pickup, um, in these um, in this configuration I believe is pretty hot sounding right I mean um, back in the day taking out a p90 and popping in a mini was a way to go for some people and you don't see this that often so having a mini normally you'd see maybe a, a junior cut like this with a p90 but with the firebird mini the monster mini uh, it sounds you get this <laughs> this thing to clean up pretty quickly so um, you know okay, so the so from 10 to about uh, going down to almost 8 you get uh, it cleans up really nicely and you can go even lower from that and get super clean I'm down to like about three and a half four and
think this is the right guitar with the right pickup combination. You're gonna dig it. It's, it's rock and roll and and, um, and and expressive, which is ultimately what you want to be able to do. So one other one other component that you got to think about and one must consider to play rock and roll or any music for that matter is an amp. So we got rock and roll relic guitar, rock and roll relic guitar, Phoenix David Allen Monster Mini with two uh, two magnets and the Freeman uh, amps, which are incredible sounding amps. This is the Dirty Shirley. Dirty Shirley. <laughs> Tighter than a bleep 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 bleep, but it's tight, and that's what you want. So, Dirty Shirley, Rock and Roll Relics, David Allen, put it together, you got the shit. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.